Question 1, divides the body, or any of its parts, into left and right sections. A. Transverse plane. B. Frontal plane. C. Sagittal plane. D. Distal. Question 1 Answer, C. Sagittal plane. Question 2, the amount of force a muscle or a muscle group can deliver up during a single contraction. A. Muscular strength. B. Muscular endurance. C. Lateral. D. Supination. Question 2 Answer, A. Muscular strength. Question 3, toward the front. A. Superior. B. Posterior. C. Anterior. D. Inferior. Question 3 Answer. C. Anterior. Question 4. Toward the back. A. Posterior. B. Inferior. C. Superior. D. Anterior. Question 4 Answer. A. Posterior. Question 5. Toward the end of the limb, origin of the structure, or midline of the body. A. Dorsal. B. Medial. C. Cervical. D. Proximal. Question 5. Answer. D. Proximal. Question 6. Internal, inward, or external, outward, turning about the vertical axis of bone. A. Pronation. B. Elevation. C. Aversion. D. Rotation. Question 6 Answer. D. Rotation. Question 7. Rotating the hand and wrist laterally from the elbow. A. Superior. B. Rotation. C. Supination. D. Pronation. Question 7 Answer, C. Supination. Question 8, Divides the body into anterior and posterior parts. A. Frontal plane. B. Pronation. C. Sagittal plane. D. Rotation. Question 8 Answer, A. Frontal plane. Question 9. The sole or bottom of the foot. A. Anterior. B. Plantar. C. Lateral. D. Lumbar. Question 9 Answer. B. Plantar. Question 10. The ability of the heart, blood, and lungs to deliver an adequate supply of oxygen to exercising muscles. A. Depression. B. Dorsiflexion. action. C. Cardiorespiratory endurance. D. Muscular endurance. Question 10 Answer. C. Cardiorespiratory endurance. Question 11. Rotating the hand and wrist medially from the elbow. A. Pronation. B. Rotation. C. Supination. D. Elevation. Question 11 Answer A. Pronation Question 12 The number of repeated contractions a muscle or muscle group can perform against resistance without fatiguing. A. Muscular endurance B. Lateral C. Muscular strength D. Transverse plane Question 12 Answer A. Muscular endurance Question 13, away from the head. A. Anterior. B. Inferior. C. Inversion. D. Superior. Question 13 Answer, B. Inferior. Question 14, moving toward the midline. A. Rotation. B. Abduction. C. Adduction. D. Pronation. Question 14 Answer, C. Adduction Question 15, 
moving to an inferior position, only at the scapula. A. Depression. B. Aversion. C. Inversion. D. Extension. Question 15 Answer A. Depression. Question 16 Lifting the lateral border of the foot. A. Aversion. B. Flexion. C. Inversion. D. Extension. Question 16 Answer A. Aversion. Question 17 Away from the midline of the body. A. Lumber. B. Planter. C. Distal. D. Lateral. Question 17 Answer. D. Lateral. Question 18. Toward the midline of the body. A. Medial. B. Distal. C. Dorsal. D. Cervical. Question 18 Answer. A. Medial. Question 19. The sum of fat and fat-free weight. A. Abduction. B. Body composition. C. Supination. D. Adduction. Question 19 Answer. B. Body composition. Question 20. Regional term referring to the portion of the back between the abdomen and the pelvis. A. Distal. B. Plantar. C. Dorsal. D. Lumber. Question 20 Answer. D. Lumber. Question 21. Increasing the angle between two bones. A. Extension. B. Aversion. C. Depression. D. Inversion. Question 21 Answer. A. Extension. Question 22. Moving the sole of the foot downward, pointing the toes. A. Anterior. B. Dorsiflexion. C. Flexion. D. Plantar flexion. Question 22. Answer. D. Plantar flexion. Question 23. External, located to or on the surface. A. Superior. B. Proximal. C. Superficial. D. Cervical. Question 23. Answer. C. Superficial. Question 24. Regional term referring to the neck. A. Medial. B. Cervical. C. Proximal. D. Superficial. Question 24. Answer. B. Cervical. Question 25. Moving to a superior position, only at the scapula. A. Elevation. B. Aversion. C. Pronation. D. Flexion. Question 25. Answer. A. Elevation. Question 26. Away from the attached end of the limb, origin of the structure, or midline of the body. A. Lumbar. B. Medial. C. Dorsal. D. Distal. Question 26. Answer. D. Distal. Question 27. Moving the top of the foot toward the shin. A. Plantar flexion. B. Flexion. C. Dorsiflexion. D. Dorsal. Question 27. Answer. C. Dorsiflexion. Question 28. Lifting the medial border of the foot. A. Aversion. B. Inversion. C. Extension. D. Inferior. Question 28. Answer. B. Inversion. Question 29. The amount of movement that can be accomplished at a joint. A. Proximal. B. Flexibility. C. Extension. D. Flexion. Question 29. Answer. B. Flexibility.
Question 30. Motion away from the midline of the body. A. Elevation. B. Adduction. C. Rotation. D. Abduction. Question 30. Answer. D. Abduction. Question 31. The top surface of the foot and hands. A. Dorsal. B. Distal. C. Lumbar. D. Medial. Question 31. Answer. A. Dorsal. Question 32. Regional term referring to the portion of the body between the abdomen, also known as the chest. A. Rotation. B. Thoracic. C. Pronation. D. Dorsal. Question 32. Answer. B. Thoracic. Question 33. Divides the body, or any of its parts, into superior and inferior sections. A. Transverse plane. B. Sagittal plane. C. Inversion. D. Frontal plane. Question 33. Answer. A. Transverse plane. Question 34. Toward the head. A. Inferior. B. Anterior. C. Posterior. D. Superior. Question 34. Answer. D. Superior. Question 35. Decreasing the angle between two bones. A. Dorsiflexion. B. Flexion. C. Aversion. D. Elevation. Question 35. Answer. B. Flexion.